Today's video is sponsored by Microjig, maker of the gripper. Work safer, work smarter. So this is my wiener dog, Weens. Weens is nearly 10 years old. He can go upstairs, but has never been able to go down a full flight. He can go down the four steps to get to the backyard, but as he gets older, it becomes increasingly more difficult for him. He's a little stubborn and has refused to learn to go down one step at a time. Instead, he always goes full sprint out the back door and tries to hurdle the last step. So it's time to build Weens a handicap ramp. The thought is to build it next to the back steps, and if we only open the door slightly, he'd have no choice but to use the ramp. And since he only needs to use the ramp to go down and not up, the thought is it could be a little steeper than a normal handicap ramp and not interfere with the gate to the driveway. I'm using pressure treated wood from the home center. For outdoor projects like this, you'll want to use pressure treated woods for long term protection against rot, fungal decay, and insects. I drew up the plans in SketchUp and to my eye I thought it looked like a decent slope for the ramp. Everything is joined together with pocket hole screws. I just got the new Craig K5 system which makes this crazy easy and fast. I'm building the ramp into two segments, the top platform and the ramp section with the thought that if the ramp is at the wrong angle it could easily be modified without deconstructing the whole thing. As I was screwing in the slats, it became pretty obvious that this was going to be way too steep and it turns out that was the case. Weens absolutely refuses to use the ramp. So it turns out this project was a complete failure, but I suck at failures because I refuse to let it defeat me. There are a couple things that I can do. I could just extend it out even further, but like I mentioned earlier, it'll interfere with the back gate. I could have it come down so far and then make a turn this way but then that interferes with human activities because we like to have cookouts, campfires, and movies here on the back patio. I could also have it come down and to one final step as he doesn't seem to have much of a problem with one step. But then it hit me. What if I build a ramp over the steps that is on casters that can be wheeled out of the way when it's not needed and even have the bottom part of it hinged to fold up and out of the way. So I think I'm gonna scrap the entire project and start over. And I don't think I would have had this idea if I didn't fail at this first. Even though this wasn't a successful project, I still hope you got something out of it. That it doesn't hurt to try and fail. Fail as much as you can. You might be surprised how much you learn. All right, thanks for watching. Stay passionate and make something. <music>